Yeah, well, tell me what you're thinking. There's no stink. This is the colorway of the year. It is one of the top five best colorways I've seen in any shoe in my lifetime because it is insane. It's and <sighs> Two Face is my favorite Batman villain. Yo, what is up, you two? This is Pure Kicks back again with another performance review. And for those who have not read the title just yet, today we're taking a look at the Adidas Dame Sixes. Let's get it. Yeah. Firstly, massive shout out to the family over at Pro Direct Basketball. If you would like your pair of the Dame Sixes or anything basketball related, head over to their website. The link will be in the description box below and just live life. That's it. But of course, as per usual, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to your boys. Like this video, show your support. Comment down below your thoughts on the Dame 6 and this colorway. We can get into the colorway a little bit later. Yep. And of course, hit that beautiful red button that says subscribe on it to get notified every time we drop a new video. When I say notified, you have to hit the bell to get notified. But that's just part of the steps. Hit subscribe, hit the bell, get notified every time we drop a new video. All right, real quick, let them know who we're talking about today. Let them know who we're dealing with. What, D. Lily? That guy. Dame Dodo. Yeah, same guy. Tell him. Lo Logo Lillard. That guy. Talk to them. Talk to Mister, them. Mr. Hit a game winning shot. Arguably the greatest playoff game winning shot of all time. And wave him goodbye. That guy. That guy. That guy. That guy. That guy. That guy. Tell him. Damien Lillard is officially on his sixth signature shoe. Mad thing. And this shoe is absolutely incredible. Obviously, we're getting to the madness throughout the performance of you. But this shoe is beautiful aesthetically. First off, it is aesthetically pleasing. Pleasing! The colorway is beautiful and it oh only excites God. me more for, for the potential colorways that are to come. Yeah, no, no, no. It's going to be tough to follow. It's going to be extremely tough to follow. So, without further ado, let's just get straight into this shoe. Starting things off, of course, as we always do, our favorite part of the shoe, or at least the part that jumped out to us the most, yep. it's going to be the cushioning. And none other, of course, than Logo Lily has finally joined the, I want to say the premium cushioning system. Yeah, the gang. The gang. Before, he's been known as a bounce don. He's yeah. been the leader of bounce. Bounce is not broken. We love bounce yeah, we still. we love bounce. At the time, it was a boost thing. Yeah. But now we're dealing with light strike. What? Because what do you get in light strike? I mean, you get response first of First all. off. Yeah, the energy return is dumb. Incredible. Yeah. Court feel is there. There. Keeper protection is there. there. And above everything else, it's a light cushioning oh, system. Oh, come on. That is ridiculously comfortable. You know when you say that, right? It's a light cushioning system. It doesn't add to weight and everything like that. But you have to remember, it's full length. Yep. This is light strike, heel to toe. Everywhere is yep. light strike, right? Yep. Which means it's just comfortable. Yeah. Oh my God. And it, it's actually perfect because, we, I mean, we both feel like the overall theme with the shoe is lightweight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. we'll get to more. Yeah, we'll it's get to a more real now. light shoe. Ooh, we'll get to that. Adidas to implement light strike into the shoe, it only makes sense. Only makes sense. And only does great things on the basketball court. I mean, great things have to come with great scores. And if you have to give it a score, it's easily a strong nine out of 10. It's a nine out of 10. Strongest of nines. Oh, quit playing. Should you just keep it moving? Move on, bro. Run the play. Now, our next favorite part of the shoe are the materials. Over here in the Dame 6, we have an overall textile mesh construction Easy. and some hints of suede, most notably on the lateral side yep. and on the toe box as well. Yep. Now, performance wise, it's the textile mesh that does the job. Yeah. You know, we believe that they've added these, the, the suede mainly for bonding. Yeah. And that toe box area as well, you know, you, you could say it's for toe drags, but I don't think you really pull your toe that far. Mm. So it's just a textile mesh, basically. Yeah, it's textile mesh doing the thing. And it bats. Severely. But oh my days, it feels so good on foot. It, wow. it might be the lightest shoe I think I've worn ever. Yeah, it's in the game. It's, it's at least it's in, in the, the game. game. It's in the, the game. The shoe up there. is so light. Yes. You take him up the box, it requires no breaking Zero. time. Zero. Zero breaking time. Zero. Oh, wow. Maybe minus breaking time. I think they As might if... have broken it in, in factory. That's and what I'm saying. And when you get the shoe out the box, you're good to go. It might be that thing. It is that ridiculous. Rotted. And then the materials combined with that cushioning system, yep. it is, 
Not only do I think it's the most comfortable day so far. Oh, yeah. I think it's the most comfortable shoe of the year. Ooh, I'm with it. Yep. I agree. What else can we really say? We have to give it a score. Nine out of 10 again. It's gonna work for me. Nine out of 10 a again. Young nine out of 10. Let's keep moving. Next up, we're talking about the fit. Yeah. Now, the Dame 6 is a sock-like shoe. Yeah. The half booty construction, and basically how it's built, the tongue itself is built into the rest of the shoe, yeah. and only half of it is kind of cut down inside the shoe. Mm -hmm. So it does feel like a sock when it goes on. Now, it's a snug-like sock fit. Yeah, 100%. It is. However, that's when you've got two socks on. Yeah. Because they're a little bit roomy, so if you don't go with two socks, you could just get a half size down. Yeah, you'd be all right. But if Pure Kicks are talking to you, man, like on a level, on a level, go true and do the two sock thing. Because it feels buff. Fam? Tell him, oh tell him. my God. Comfort just goes up and up and up and up. I'm telling you on this one. We're telling you on this one, yeah? You can just go half size. That's cool too. Yeah, do your thing. Because it's it, a nice shoe. If that's what you want to do, if you want to be extra and go half if, size if you, out, if you want to just be different it, and just, just be annoying, that's fine. That's up to you. We're not judging. I'm judging, but <laughs> Pure Kicks is telling you, go true, try the double sock thing. At least even if you're trying them on in store, if you can get them tried on, bring two sock, keep your true size, and you'll see what we're talking about. Because yeah. they felt fantastic. I loved them. They were close to foot. They really hugged well. The lacing system is kind of these um, yeah, I was about belts. to the lacing system still exactly. because it feels so good. So what's really good about the kind of lacing system is that they're like belts, which means they take away from weight. They don't add any other materials yep. and they just kind of hug the foot really well, especially in the midfoot as well. Another thing I really liked was the way that the tongue and this pull tab at the back hug your ankle yes. in a weird way. You know what I'm saying? They, do, yeah. they don't really hug it too much because obviously there's a lot of space here, but these two pieces yeah. just like touch the front and the back yeah. and it feels... A1. Yeah. It's been in like really, ah, yeah. ah, bro. They, they bang. I like them a lot. 100%, bro. But I have to be honest, the whole half size double sock thing is going to lose some things. You yeah. don't want, it's not confusing or anything, because it's not, we just told you how it's supposed to be done. Yeah. But you're going to have to lose a little something on that. Yeah, so the score, it's eight out of 10. Eight out of 10. The strongest of eights. It's the strongest eight I think we've ever given. So no more. The strongest of eights, because we have to just be, you'd be good because of the half size double sock thing. But, yeah. Double sock ten. Sorry, T, quickly, just before yeah. we move on, I know you mentioned the tongue. Yes, of course. But I just, you know what? Let me just show these guys, man. What are you doing? Where's my bag at, man? Bam. Oh, here we, here we go. He's going to do all that for. Sorry about that. No Look, see your sock. we came from practice today, yeah? Yeah. Look at this. Can you guys see this? Can you guys see this? It's pink. Oh, you're doing a madness. Can you guys see that? It's pink. You guys see that? It's pink, yeah? From the tongue. All right, moving on. Has that got anything to do with performance though, really? Moving on. Next up, talking about traction. Now over here in the Dame Sixes, we have the Don't Fix It If It Ain't Broke Herringbone Traction Pattern and Did It Bang? Yes, indeed. Oh my days, it was amazing. Come on. The, the, the way it sticks to the ground is absolutely beautiful. We definitely think it comes from the compound of the rubber. Mm -hmm. We're not sure if we'll see a solid rubber outsole in the Dame Six. We should though, we should, surely. Even if we don't, I'm yeah. not mad at it. True, there you go. Yeah. Yes, there is a bit of dust collection. Of course there is. Yes, this shoe is designed for NBA floors and not your regular, you know, gym where it's super dusty. Mm. So expect dust collection. Expect it. But once you wipe it, you're calm. Yeah, you're good, you're hooping. You're good to go. Wherever you want to go, if you want to jab step and step back and hit a free, the traction's got you. If you want a Euro, the traction's got you, yeah? If you want to do a little behind the back dribble and then pull up for free, don't worry, the traction's got you. I mean, so all of that being said, it's an eight out of 10 thing. That's an eight out of 10 thing. The traction is really, really good. I wouldn't take these outdoors, especially if they don't give us a solid rubber outsole. Especially. Especially, because this stuff will wear away instantly if you play these outdoors, but indoors you are good to go. I will say, I really feel like Adidas is clocked herringbone. I don't know they what have. it is. They have. They use it in a lot of shoes, and they've really clocked it. Herringbone will hold up really well outdoors, especially if it's solid. They, they smacked it. They smacked it. And last, 
and Leesley. Yep. It's a support. Now, it's a good supporting shoe. Yes. It's going to be, we're talking about Damien Lillard, he's going to need that support. You can't run from one side of the court to the other, clap in your hand, grab the shoe, come off two and just bang a bang playoff game-winning shot. You can't step back from the logo. And just hit so that, saying, wave goodbye it. without support. Yeah. The shoe has to be supportive. Mm -hmm. However, we just talked about how amazingly light these materials were. Yeah. Because they were flexible, they were breathable, they were lightweight. They, they tick all those boxes yeah. incredibly. And when you tick boxes that well, support's gonna have to take a hit. Yeah. Because you're not gonna feel as strapped in, locked in as you do whenever you use materials such as leathers yeah. or suede or even uh, just more structured meshes. Yeah. So you're kind of losing a little something, but you're gaining in terms of that material. Yeah. Now, the score is a seven. The score is a very, it's, it's a good it's seven. It's a good seven. To get a seven with materials like that, yeah. it's pretty amazing. Yeah, you guys did an amazing job at that. They kind of killed it. They to did. even get an above average score with a shoe this light. And order. this low cut as well. And this low cut. Come on, bro. So you're, you're doing something right. I yeah. probably think it comes from the lacing system. Yes. Even reeling things off. We do have the outrigger shape. Yeah. We do have the uh, internal heel counter. We do. The lacing system, as I mentioned, is the kind of the belts, which helps with the midfoot. Yeah. And that's pretty much it. There is some in um, in a the, the there's some padding the on the Achilles, yeah. which is really good for that. Helps on the on the comfort side. Yeah. All of those things come together to get you a seven out of ten when we're talking support. Really, really well. Only thing is the materials are gonna be so flexible, you're just gonna feel a little not locked in as much as you'd like to be. I didn't actually take the score on my calculator. This is just off my <laughs> No, let's, let's leave it, trust me. All right, cool, if it's wrong, let's, you're- Let's, let's live life on the edge. I just live life on the edge. <laughs> let's, let's live life on the edge. If it's wrong, tell us in the comments, because it's Flo's <laughs> fault. Keep that in there. <laughs> <laughs> Now taking all the scores into consideration, the Adidas Dame 6 comes out at an 8.2 out of 10. Brother, six shoes in and you're still wrapping up eights. It's phenomenal. Let that sizzle one time in your sizzle. spirit. In, it's right here. 8.2 out of 10. Okay. Where does that all come from? Firstly, the cushioning system is ruthless. And they made that very clear. Very clear yeah not to mention the materials are incredibly lightweight and they're very comfortable it did take a little bit a hit on the fit of course it would but double up on socks or go down half the size and you will find the traction also bangs and the support is also very good very good for what it is very good so six it. shoes in what more do you want man honestly that is everything from us. Massive shout out to Prederick Basketball again. If you would like your pair of the amazingly ruthless Dame Sixes, Come on. head over to our description box below. Click the link to their website where they will indeed take care of your Dame Six basketball needs. I mean, once you're done with that, or even before you do that, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Like this video, show your support to your boys. It helps us out so, so much. And make sure you hit that like button. Comment down below your thoughts on the Ruthless colorway and the Dame 6 in general. What colorways have you, are you excited about coming later? Or are you just happy as hell with this colorway because it is the best colorway so far? It's gonna be because it's incredible. And of course, hit that subscribe button and the bell next to it to get notified every time we drop a new video performance review or a comparison because we've got some bad boy comparisons coming for this yeah, bad boy yeah, yeah we've got yeah. bear coming yeah, yeah what yeah ah oh, it's got it's about to go mad make sure you hit that yeah. bell get notified when we drop them thing there hit me say so right guys that's everything from us this is the adidas dame six we're pure kicks let's get it is lovely. It's too much. Bro, how much do these cost? 85 comes to mind? Is that the right number? You're joking. 85. The Dame, the Dame 5s were 85 or, or 90 max. I'm Don't checking. Know sell. 85. I'm going with 85. I'm checking. Check them. You should trust me though still. You shouldn't be checking. Oh my, the 89. 89. Basically, 90 pound, probably the 85. Rotted. How did he get light strike for ninety pound? 
Fam, they niced him. Wow. Steve, every other shoe with light strike is definitely over 100 pounds. Like, by far over 100 pounds. That is amazing. You know what that makes Dame? He is the realest hooper in the game. Yeah, he's a real one. Hands down. He's a real one. Because he's the only hooper who said, I want the kids to be able to afford my shoe. I want my shoe to be affordable for everyone to get them. Because when he was younger, some of the shoes were too expensive. And he wanted to have his own and make them affordable for everyone. And he's the only one who's kept to his word. Because other hoopers have said the same thing, but they've all ended up over 100. 85 for your six shoe. 89, sorry. Or 85 and 89 for your six shoe. I'm speechless. Light, That's real. Light strike for 85. I'm going home. Again? 